to get you driving. Did you hear that? <laughs> it's fine. I'd love for you to get arrested. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> we'll take the camera and film. Oh, I'd have filmed that for sure. <laughs> That Instagram wild me. Hey, I'm on that. Oh, for sure. Rich. What? Stop her. <laughs> it's yeah, happening. Leave Dre alone. It's happening again. Ball, <laughs> Turn it off. It's 11. We need to go. Okay, baby. Thank you, Sean. All right, Coach. Are we going to take this? Stuff. I'm turning him in. As soon as we get there, I'm going to be like, hey, he's not actually a medium. Talk to what is that? Seminole. You want some? For like, really? I mean... What's up, Dre? You're being awfully okay, quiet. I was just thinking. About what? Make sure I had everything. Like, look at it. Make sure I had my shoes. My belt. You don't really need much for this workout. Yeah, it's fine. And a hamstring. Say bye to it. All of them. See ya. It's still warm. Hillary, you drank. Do you check out this pin on my back? How long do you think this workout's gonna take you guys? What? Just a little over three minutes. Okay, so we'll be back. Well, like three minutes per pair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. So it's fast. So basically, I'm gonna get my heart rate really high in the warm. Hey, did you eat my barbell bar thingy, Majiggy? <laughs> You did, didn't you? We, we move it 15, 12, 9. So 15 deadlifts, 15 burpees. Move it. 12 deadlift, 12 burpee, move it. 9 deadlift, 9 burpee. Then you bugger off. The other team moves it to, to the 36. Bugger off. 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 Um, then the second pair does 36, 36 on the one square the whole time. Just pure suckage. All 36, okay. drop and do 36 burpees. Uh, the guys bar, the guys weight will be on the left as you face the bar. Okay. Oh. On the left it is a 40 pound difference. I did the, did the math. Is that what we did in training? We did a 30 pound difference. Okay. So the, Sorry, the right. weight will be uh, 235 on our side and 195 on the girls' side. I use 195 on a practice. Plus a 35 pound bar to make it. It's going to be flat. It can't be anywhere else. Um, the burpees are done. Oh opposite. wow! It's okay. a team Someone hills. steps over and you. Yeah. Oh, that's opposite. better because then. Yeah. We still keep it. It's fine. How we practice? No, no, no. But no, no, no. Yeah, it's good. But I meant like now we're away from each other. We're not gonna. Yeah. You can drop the bar, but but don't. Yeah. It's a shorty bar. And you lose a finger. Lose a toe. You ready for this workout? Yeah, it's gonna be a little heavy, but. How do you think you'll do? I don't know. Honestly, I'm just gonna try to hold on to the deadlift and really fast on the burpees and just see. That was a good answer. Oh, angles have changed, Dre. My BMO is sore. Your what's sore? The, your BMO. You know, like in the inside? Definitely. What is that called? Vastus medialis. Oh, okay. I only know that because when I had knee surgery, like it was all about like trying to redevelop like your BMO to get your leg strength back. What did you have surgery on? I tore my patellofemoral ligament, like a little ligament that attaches like, I don't know, somewhere in here. How'd you do that? Gymnastics. My leg got caught in a mat when I was doing like a, a vault. So I was coming down and my leg got caught in a mat and my knee kept going. It was so bad. No, because it was like a traumatic dislocation, so it was like stuck out there. Like they, I, they braced me with my kneecap out, took me to the hospital, and then the doctor put it back in. How do you like this workout, Chase? I like it. I've done it twice. Who's yeah. doing the 36s? Kristen and I. Okay. How you feeling, Brittany? I feel great. Feeling good. Ready to go. Is it weird doing deadlifts with weights that he's eight eight feet tall? Actually, surprisingly, you know I mean? we're good. Just like, no, did you see us? His arms are like so long. His yeah. arms are longer, but like actually, it, it was better than I thought. We're fine. 
I'm gonna kill him on the burpees. Like, I don't even know what's happening. I love that Ridge is like, we're gonna go 12, okay, cool. Nine, I'm like, okay, and I'm always like, sorry, yeah, eight, and I'm like. Should have been you. Actually, I was really happy. You ready to run? You got everything? I got him. World of hurt, like blackout hurt. No, you don't get me on camera. Are you competing this weekend? No. Yeah, you are. No, I'm not. What are you doing? Uh, what man. place are you in? Uh, 14th. What, what division? Um, intermediate, scaled, females. Oh, that explains a lot. What's happening? How's Tia doing? She's doing good. Last day today. So it's what? Sunday, it's been four days comp. It's been pretty good. It's been hit and miss with the weather, but the crowd's pretty electric, as you see. Yeah, she's in the first, obviously. Yeah, she's, so she's at first at the moment. I think she's got a 16 point clearance, what? I think. She's got a 16 point clearance at the moment, two workouts to go. She's on in about an hour and 20 from now. The 12, 9, 6, 9, 12, deadlift 225, and burpees over the bar. I think she's very confident in, in, in the two movements themselves. I think just hearing all the other elements involved where the, uh, the stage kind of slopes slightly, which will make the bar move through the burpees, and, and hearing the, uh, the consistency and the judging with the reps will sort of be a factor to talk about dialing in a warm-up but I think we're worried for a good workout. Did it feel a little different? No, it went really well. Me and Fee. I was worried about that workout. Me personally, I don't like deadlift workouts. And the other three guys love it. We did the 15, the 12 and break them. The 9 went 6-3 because I was literally at like my red red light, red line. We we were like, oh we were literally the third team to, to start the second pair. They were announcing they're like top three is independence. Chase got messed up because the the, on his side, the collar slipped, Ooh. and the plate was plates was off the collar by like four or five inches. So it made, so he was lifting like 60 pounds more, not 40. And they legitimately had to do their last three reps as singles. Chase was like, he was going to his freaking toes. He'd hold there, the judge was like, ah, not locked out enough. Like he would literally, I see him saying no. Chase would have to like send it into a freaking like shrug. He was like, and good. We got fifth, fourth in the heat, fifth overall. Okay. Victor Groups came ninth. Wow. We've got a 31 point lead now heading wow. into the final workout. That's huge for you guys. What we're going to do is stay ahead of them. Yeah. If they beat us, just gonna stay right behind them. Yeah. Good man, good day. We just gotta, it's not over. You know what I mean? It's not over. You did amazing. You know First thing Royce did. So good. And yeah. when, we when we ran and tagged you guys, I laid Crumble. down. Crumble! I'm going to black out. I thought I was going to black out on the finish line. How did you no. feel after that? She's like, the red dot. You know why though? I'll tell you why. Because we only had to do it one time. Yeah. I've been uh, saying that was after a, every was workout. Was ten and run it back. Yeah. But it was it actually I felt amazing too because I knew we'd done our job. Well, also like you chip away at too big of a set, then you're ruined for the entire workout. You almost want them to set. You, you want them to go exactly. go out hot and get and get eaten alive. But it was good because I think the entire time we kept a steady like we kept a steady rhythm on our deadlifts, steady pace throughout, like push it to the end. We were good. Do you see how I'm celebrating? I do better to celebrate other people. I smashed that button. I was so. I was like, I was you guys were going, and I was like, ah! yeah. I heard you guys.
guys were like, go! And I was like, hi y'all. I can't! I was saying go and you were like 15 reps because I had no idea what reps awesome. you were at. But I was just like, don't let them get in front of you. Because you're usually crushing my lungs are, burpees. My lungs are. Yeah, yeah, brain yeah. lungs. That hurt. Deadlift you was awful. Like, yeah, I moved your harder. plates in for you once. Did you see that? Yeah, I saw you come out. I didn't know what you were doing, but the, what happened was when you deadlift, the plates would shift out, so I just racked them and put the clip back on. I, go, I that was that first set. She's like, "Come on, my side, just help me get through that first set." And I was like, "If it feels good, come back come over." Back. And like she never came back. Just, you, you scooted your hands over. <laughs> I just went a little bit more on her side. And I, the reason I knew I was over there is because like I was hurting and I had to pause at the top yeah. and she just knew to stand because I had more of the <laughs> the bar in her hand, I think. That sounds like typical uh, typical Tasia. Yeah, she, she <laughs> <laughs> Then she buried me into the ground on the burpees. Yeah. You buried me. Hey, you buried me on those burpees. I was, I was like, like, so was like okay, I'm sorry. I like my lungs you know you're are not, still Tasia. burning. <laughs> I was like, that wasn't nine. Than well, that, I think though the the men's side was just it was just heavier. Uh, it was horrible. So, so you, in theory, you still asked Scott to uh, do it over more on the deadlift. But the, only on the first set, and then I helped. The biggest set. Oh, I didn't know. He's okay. That's how I guess. Scott, were you okay? Did it feel heavier than? It's just not okay. <laughs> I think on the set of nine, I felt better, but I was already like at that point because on twelve. The only reason I know I had more of the bar is because on 11, I held it at the top and I needed to stand and you didn't go down. And there was, was like, a team. Tasia. When I survived those deadlifts, I was like, I'm good. Are you guys going home? Yeah, thanks for being my fan. Are you ready to rumble? <laughs> I'm about to throw up. <laughs> And you had all weekend. Anytime I stand up, no matter what it is, I get super tizzy. It's good, right? Because you told yourself that you didn't need to eat because you didn't deserve a bite. That's true. Rich starved himself because he gave me the heavy bag yesterday. He was so mad he didn't deserve it. Yeah, yeah, as punishment. Did you see this picture? Sam Briggs came up to me and she was like, "Did you see that picture of you holding?" the entire heavy part of the worm. And I was like, Sam, I lived it, live. <laughs> She's like, Jay just got the heavy bag and Rich and China are on the front two bags. I have like Where? two bags um, to my side. I thought I was in the middle. I thought they said be in the middle no, of the I know, red. But yeah. Sam was like, she's like, I can't believe you're holding that. I'm like, me neither in my head. I'm like, you are so weak, Tasia. <laughs> that you can't hold this 70 pound bag. But now it's funny. Okay. Yeah, it's funny. Look at us now. Look at us now, we can look, laugh about it. Look how far we, we've come. <laughs> What's on the menu? No, yeah. Oh gosh, I can't get out. Killer's in the house. Can you just start freaking out? Sorry, locked. Look at that. I think I think it does it automatically, right? Yeah. Good. Stand by. Three, two, one, go. 25 wall balls, fake it. Got it. 21, 22, 23, 24. Switch. Good, we do 25. 48, 49, 50. 75. 74, 75. 75. 98, 98, 99, 100. Now you guys pick them. I go to a row, so once to ski. Okay, so Scott go to ski. And then I follow Scott. Yeah. Correct. You yeah. follow Scott, Scott, I follow okay. Tasia. Tasia okay. rows 15. I row 25. You, row, you do 25 and 40. then I do. We switch. Okay, then I'm Scott. Ski. Got it. I'm skiing. Now we go to dumbbell snatch. So, so it'll be Scott and Tasia again. Tasia. We'll go back to snatch. Dumbbell snatch. 
good would you guys want it to do? Well, if we potentially have to do 12 8 or something yeah. like that. Got it. We're and tag. We're up tag. We're tag. We do, we're once, tag. We, once we hit 60, yeah. so now it's, we say we fit. Whoever finishes last, the right. next pair goes and starts box jump over. So you go over and back. Tag over the board. Yeah, you got me in We do two. Back, tag. Okay, 40. 40. Cool. That's just going to be like, all right, I think we'll like, talk. We can yeah, be talking. We talk. can talk, yeah. Okay. You want that one? Yeah. All 30 of them. What's up, Trey? What are you guys talking about? He's no. trying to see if he can jump from here no, to there. No, I'm not trying to see Drake. I know I can do it, he but I'm not going to do it. He can't do it. He's not doing it right now. Let's go. No balls. Oh, no. Don't do it. Why? You no, do, do it. it. Yeah, I can do it. <laughs> oh. The man. Robin Grayson. One more. <laughs> Sorry, that first one I was so narrow. Like a week in advance. Here's the question, is it being more fit to hop over to not walk around? And doing constantly buried? Or is it lazy to hop over the fence? Comment below. Rich, it's being fit. Is it? Yeah, I think so. Using your fitness? Yeah. So Anton, why did you take people down? What did they do wrong? Uh, they all want to get in the VIP. <laughs> you, earned, you earned your place in the VIP. I say rich, I'm rich, I'm rich, I'm rich, I'm rich. them a first place overall finish here this weekend. Give it up for Mayhem Freedom! Absolute fantastic job here guys this weekend. I know I appreciate you guys as a fan of CrossFit and just overall fantastic people. Thank you guys. We'll see you somewhere very soon. Chase, how's it feel? Made it, Dre. Finally? Finally. Heck yeah, man. Congrats. Thank you. Good job, guys. Proud of you. That's awesome. Good job, bro. Crushed it. Great weekend. Made it. I wish we'd have done better on that workout. <laughs> <laughs>
I mean, you clenched it. What? You still clenched it. I know. I'm so stoked. I don't think it really sets in until I actually like, see it on paper. It's official then. So we're, we're related, but not related. We're not blood related. He's Hillary's uh, cousin, first cousin. And so for years, I tried to get him to do CrossFit. He's like, no, no. You know, it's said, stupid. Well, then I finally got him to do CrossFit. And then, what, a week later, you moved to Knoxville? And so he started doing CrossFit in Knoxville, which is like an hour and a half away from us. And then, like, what, a year later, opened a gym, like, all this stuff, doing incredibly well for himself. It's a really cool gym. Uh, but then when the, the rules, he was actually going to be on independence. Um, when the rules weren't, you had to work all in the same same place. But then when they changed the rules last year, it made it easier because he didn't have to commute as much. And so it's been cool to watch just the, the hard work he puts in, the transformation, super fit. So I'm excited. Happy for you, buddy. The nicest thing you've ever said. Ten years in the making. It's on camera now, so. Yeah. Can you guys send me that? Most people probably don't know that you guys are like cousins. Yeah, cousins, kind of. Yeah. Not really. Not, I know we look a lot alike. alike. Yeah, we look just alike. Uh, Good job, Tasia. I was sick. That was all you. I, I saw from my angle that you pushed it first, so I knew. I, I saw it too. And I felt like I felt good about it. It wasn't like way ahead, but it was like a noticeable yeah, it was like. A touch. Video stuff, I got like it. Oh, you're good, Frankie. Tasia saves the day. No, I think I saw it. That's it episode was. Tasia saves the day. Yeah, yeah. Tasia saves the season. <laughs> I mean, they're there for that. They were here for their thing. We were here for our thing. We both did it. So that's it. Exactly. And even you got what you came here for. Got that sweet, sweet content. And four double under workouts in four days. <laughs> we have a weekend off. So, th so those guys go back to Tennessee for about four or five days, and then they're gonna. Um, oh! oh! You son of a biscuit. You're lucky it's small. Well, yeah. <laughs> Aim small, miss small. Um, so they, they have like, yeah, like four or five days back in Tennessee and they fly out on next, on next weekend. And then we have that week until the, uh, the Australia CrossFit Champs. So it's, for me, it's, when I, I get home, I have like a week and a half, which is heaps of time, really, honestly. But my brother didn't win the sprint right either. I'm gonna do this. Gives me really excited for the future. Well done. Okay, thank you, Harold. Thank you. Wit's going to officially decline their invite tonight, and then they're going to announce that we got it. Hey, Joe, what do you have to say to all your fans? Thanks for being my fans. <laughs> Did you see I threw that at the end? Yeah, when you walked out here. I was like, you shouldn't do this, but it's kind of funny. That's not my symbol. Peace. Yeah, right. That's so messed up. You can't say that. Nice signature, Chase. When Kiki asked me to ask the question, I was going to be like, my question is, can I have your rucksack, Rich? You have like 15, can I have it? Did you say you want to have his nutsack? No, rock, rucksack. Oh, I thought you said my nutsack. <laughs> I mean, I have his nutsack right, too, guys. I guess. How do you feel? Good. No, oh, no. <laughs> All right. All right. Dylan. Trey, you did a crap job this weekend. So you appreciate it. You really need to well, work well, on well, your skills. Oh, my camera's not on. What'd you say? <laughs> oh. What was that? You did terrible. It, oh, it's your still videos not are terrible. You could use my back if you want. Will you also sign Royce's shirt? We're the, we're the biggest cheerleaders. <laughs> Thanks, B. Oh my gosh, thank you yeah, guys. Thank you, so like the fact that like you reached out, like trusting me to trust it. You're amazing. You, yeah, part yeah, of it, like first team experience. First team experience, first team experience yes. getting the bit to the games. I've only done team one other year. I literally feel like this is my first trip to the games with you guys. Like this feels like rookie year, like rookie year feels. It feels so good, that's so cool. In second place, Wacy Morris. Now I can't even give it away. Yeah, my 
camera out of here. A wet. We'd also like to go ahead and get the games invite out. If we can have Mayhem Independence make their way towards the podium and stand to the side.